talk about machine learning approaches to estimate plant canopy temperature for effective irrigation schedule. Hello everybody. This is Parash Kumar a PhD student in Biosystems and Agriculture Engineering Department. I'm here to present the entitled Machine Learning to Estimate Plant Canopy Temperature for Effective Irrigation Scheduling. When I was a life scientist in Bangladesh, my, my primary focus was on improving the irrigation water use efficiency. At that time, I visited numerous farmers' fields and witnessed the importance of irrigation for crop production. Irrigation is, the most, is, is one of the most important parts for, for cultivating crops, but it's very hard to apply the exact amount of water the, the crop needed. Usually farmers, Usually, farmers try to go for the high estimation of crops. That means when there is when there is a wilting point in in the crop canopy, that means they 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 go for the water. This estimation is not accurate and and varies from farmer to farmer. So the plants behave like the human body, just like us. We drink water to feel cool. Plants need the water to, to lower their temperature. That means the canopy temperature may be an option or an, an indicator to know the, the water stress of the plants. We, we, we go for the experiments and in the Oklahoma, in the, in the southwest Oklahoma of different sites. Here is an example of one site. The solid red line is the canopy temperature is the canopy temperature, observed canopy temperature data, and we modeled a, we modeled namely the LSTM over the canopy temperature and found an error under two, de two degrees Celsius. And that means it can be matched well if we go for the data driven approaches. Now, one of the limitations of my study is the higher and lower temperature of higher and lower, lower temperature values are not are not matching well to the observed data. We will be addressing this in our future research under under different soil, water, and climate conditions to predict the real time data. Thank you, everybody.